Now, the last thing that we're going to be planting today are these. They're aubergines. We've got two different sets here. We've got the long purple ones, which I grew last year, and were actually very successful. And these ones, which are called Listada de Gandia. So I think these are actually slightly shorter, or they're smaller. Um, but we'll give them both a go. We will keep these in the greenhouse to grow in the greenhouse. But we'll plant them together in a, uh, in a tray together just to see. So they do take a long time, so just be very patient with them. They're also, oh, there's too many there. They're also very sensitive to uh, the, the cold, so these have to go in a a plastic carrier bag, a plastic bag over the tray. But the, can you see it through my dirty hands? That they're very, very tiny. They're very similar to uh, to tomato ones, tomato seeds. So we'll sprinkle these on. There we are. Oops. Oh. And then we'll put some of the other ones on. It's always nice to have a couple of varieties just then you can compare but it's like the tomatoes the little balcony ones the small tiny cherry tomatoes I just like to put them in together and not know until they come up what they're going to which ones they're going to be and those are the other ones exactly the same you can never tell the difference but we will sprinkle those in here oops there we are and we'll just put a little bit of compost again on the top just to cover the seeds quick water and in a bag definitely now as I've still got lots left in the packet I've had to write a little white label so we will stick that in there as well and we will put this on the shelf with the rest of them and that's all we're going to do this time I hope you found that very useful there's no point growing things that you get in the shops it's always always worth trying something different if you don't want to try all of those fine you know grow what you like to grow start with a few bits for the first year and then gradually as the years go on and on and on then you can you know be slightly more adventurous but the best thing to do is to stick with basic things that you know I'm just showing you a whole range of, of uh, seeds to plant that I would want to do myself um, and I change every year this is the first year I've tried gherkins and, and sp specific types of, uh, of cucumbers. But it's always nice to have a go at these things, even if it's just one or two that you have a go at. Uh, we'll be planting lots more things next time. Uh, it's that season and we're, it's, everything's going to start growing and it's, ooh, it's getting very exciting. So I hope to see you then. Bye-bye.